You have prayed your best as a man. Everything you ought to do, you have done it, yet there is a failure. God permitted it so that it will not take your life. Because there are some things you continue to try and try and try and try and try. Did you hear what the Bible said in the Ecclesiastes 11? He said, cast thy bread upon the waters. Give one portion to seven. Give another portion to eight. That means that nothing is certain in life. The Bible says, you do not know the one that you brought up hold. The problem happened to you, or a situation not palatable happened to you, does not mean that you are failed for life. The difference between failing at a time and failing for life. When you fail at a time, it means that there is still an opportunity of success. The Bible says, many are the afflictions of the righteous, but God delivered him from them all. Many are the trials of men in life. You don't just become a man one day. You don't just start crawling one day. No. Anytime you give up on yourself, then your courage is dead. Let me tell you, you listen to me this morning. You need to break out of the comfort of your parents at times. Are you getting me? You can be in your parents' house, but you change the mentality of your comfort. Your parents suffer. They struggle to get whatever they have that you are benefiting from. It is not a crime to keep yourself hungry in the name of fasting to start achieving progress in life. You can be in your father's house and be making progress. You can be in your mother's house and be adding to our life. You must not leave. But there are characters you will show them. Immediately you cannot discipline your body. You cannot progress. It's not a cause. Courage is the power to apply wisdom or to understand it. There is no struggle about position or wealth except God has given it to you. The Bible says in that Ecclesiastes 11, as you do not know the ways that a child come up, that is how you don't know the ways of God. Change your mentality. Have courage. This person is selling shoe and God said go and sell shoe. It does not make you to change your mind. His own shoe might be Ambola. Your own might be Timbaland. All of them, they are high. The only thing is a name. Every shoe is to take me somewhere. The way I buy it, the way you sell it, is what you get. Don't ever be you ashamed of whatever you are doing. Because anything that you are doing legitimately that is making you to eat food is something to be proud of. Do your work with a passion and courage that there is a better tomorrow. Apostle Paul did not say he was looking at yesterday. He was looking at what is ahead. What is your own courage today?